click the bell icon and never miss another update from Bollywood Spy. I must tell you that he was an absolute... Um, I approached Hrithik and his father Rakesh Ji um, quite some time ago um, because I wanted, some, I wanted some help on this film, not for Hrithik to act in the film and um, for Krish. And um, we worked that out, time flew, everything got over and then I said, I mean, why am I holding back? I'll just go, I'll just, I'll just talk to him. If the maximum he'll say is no. And I was so used to rejections. I said, it'll be the 18th time somebody will say no, but I will jolly well go and ask him that. And I went to his house and I said, I want 15 minutes of yours. And the 15 minutes became one and a half hour. And he said, tell me one more scene and tell me one more scene and tell me one more. And he said, why would you think I would not even do this film? And I said, I don't know. I, just, I was just taking this chance that I hope you will be a part of this film. And he said, you just tell me the dates. I'm going to work this out. Whatever happens, I'm going to be a part of Rudyantar. And trust me, when you see the film, you will know how Team Rudyantar is really blessed to have him as a part of the film. Not only as an actor, but the way he, he just held my hand through. He shot on the last day of the film. He shot on the last day of the film. The pack-up was called on Rithik's uh, shot. And I still remember after that, getting to him was the easiest thing. I said, will you, will you, launch, will you tweet my launch date? And he said, of course, yes. He was upset with me a few days ago when he said, how could you launch the post teaser poster even without letting me know? I would have done it. So I just feel that sometimes actors cross the boundaries of just being an actor and a star. And that's the time you realize what a human being he is.